Mobile Police rolling out new technology to help people in times of crisis. The new addition making it possible by a federal grant and it allows officers to instantly connect with a therapist or a doctor virtually. Our Ashton Mitchell is in the studio with more on this story. Ashton, you took a look at this new tech. How does it work? Yeah, I did, Lanise, and it's a way to expand the current mental health response efforts between the Mobile Police Department and Alta Point in Mobile. Now, a quick touch of a button could save someone's life. Mental health is certainly on the rise since COVID. We've seen increased numbers in depression, anxiety, even psychosis. They're calling it a force multiplier. The overall goal was that they're not the first responders to a mental health call because it really does take a lot of time. This year alone, Mobile Police have responded to over 400 mental health calls in our community. Thanks to a $750,000 federal grant, the Mobile Police Department is introducing new technology that will immediately connect a person in mental distress with a doctor at Alta Point in Mobile, and it's all in the form of an iPad. Clinicians here at the crisis center 24 seven can respond. The officers have the iPads in their patrol vehicle, and all they have to do is hold it up for the individual who's in crisis, and we talk through what's going on. Corporal Nathaniel McCarty says the goal is to respond to people with mental health crisis the right way. The program is simple. The red button is going to be for our citizens who we encounter uh, that may be in a health crisis. But this measure isn't just for the public. There's a blue button for officers use too. Officers go through vicarious trauma every day because we're here to help our citizens when they're going through what could possibly be the worst time in their life. We have to have a way to release it. They walked us through a hypothetical play by play scenario with the new technology. Hey there, how are you doing today? I'm not doing really well right now. What's going on? had some issues at home. I lost my husband and my job is giving me problems and I'm just I'm just not I'm not dealing with it well. We can get you help. Uh, maybe get you an antidepressant. Have you ever taken one in the past? She's willing to come to the crisis center if you can transport her in. Absolutely. I'll get that done right now. Corporal McCarty says he anticipates this de-escalation technique will be a game changer. One of the biggest concerns that we have is officers responding to a scene where a person is going through a mental health crisis and us responding in a lethal manner. MPD says from October to December in 2023, 83% of mental health calls were resolved on scene. Corporal McCarty attributes this success to officers ongoing training with mental health professionals. Those numbers show that we are going in the right direction. Now the Mobile Police Department is training officers on those iPads right now. The program has already begun in Precinct 3 and they'll be distributing the iPads to the remaining precincts next week. Live in studio, Ashley Mitchell, Fox 10 News.